bring you the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. The kicker's got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. Taken from the three-yard line. Tackle made at the 28-yard line. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. He fights forward to about the 30. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 30-yard line. Steps out of bounds. Right around the 30. No gain on the play. Third down. Defensive coordinator anticipating this five-wide set, and he comes in with his dime package. Got a man. Watch out here. And he shoved out of bounds around the 47-yard line. The defense might be licking their chops right now, Herbie. We've got a change at the quarterback position. We know the kid is talented, but you got to know the defense is going to come after him. First and 10. Ball on the 47. He's at the 40. He's tackled in the open field. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 30. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That'll bring up second and three. Play fake. Quick throw to the tight end. And down he goes, around the six-yard line. Boy, when you can rely on your tight end to move the chains, you've got a big-time advantage over any defense. First and goal from the five. They're knocking on the door. And he's in there. Touchdown. That's a great job of some tough running right there. When you get close to the end zone, things get very tight. It's tough to maneuver. And he hits the PAT. A nice seven play, 71 yard drive. And that's good for a touchdown. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. The Mustangs and their coaching staff, Kirk, just happy to have a guy like this in the program. Their offense really clicks when he's playing well. Well, I think it gives them the diversity that they're looking for. I mean, at times they're going to run the football. Other times they're going to try to air it out. And when you have one guy that gets so much attention on the outside, it just seems to open up other aspects of their offensive attack. And they've done a good job as an offensive staff of putting together a good plan. And I'm sure we're going to see it again today. That makes it seven and six. From their own 32-yard line, second down. Number 14 
Jones leads into the receiver on the play. That'll bring up third and six. hit immediately. They go to the air and pick up a couple. Not much of a gain for the wide receiver, but at least he made the catch and got himself some positive yards. <laughs> Tries to get around the corner. And he's taken down at the 38. The offense really came up with a nice drive there last time out, and most of those yards came through the air. This defense needs to improve from front to back. The line needs to put more pressure on the quarterback, and the defensive backs need to stick it to these receivers with tighter coverage. And he gets a yard on the run. One thing about this linebacker over the years that separates him from the rest are his instincts and ability to make the play. That's a nice tackle by the senior. From the 37-yard line, it's second down. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Fires up to his receiver. They'll bring him down around the 27-yard line. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. Second and five. Ball on the 22. Throws on the run, and he's got his wide receiver. And he's hit immediately. Besides going deep on the fade, the slant route is probably the most commonly run route against man coverage. If the receiver gets a good inside release, it'll be a new set of downs every time. They go with the run, and he's taken down behind the line. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. That brings him second to goal. Ball inside the 10-yard line. Second down. Tackle made at the four. Stuffed. That's a loss of three yards on the play. That brings us fourth and goal. This one should be makeable. And if they can connect on this one, that'll put them up by a couple of scores. Kicks away, and it sails through the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. They'll bring him down at the 26. It's not quite a blowout, but unless they do something here, it might turn into one. Steps out right around the 28-yard line. From their own 28-yard line, it's second down. That'll bring an end to the first quarter of action. 10, nothing. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Slings it. He's taken down at about the 33-yard line. That'll bring up 32.
So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. They come out in an empty backfield. Makes the first down catch. He's knocked out of bounds at the 45-yard line. Gain of 12 yards. First down. it out to about the 46. That's a gain of nine on the play. That makes it so it's second down and about two yards to go. He takes it right side for a good game. Call it a gain of four yards. First down. Here's the give. He's tackled at the 40. From the 40-yard line. Second down. you have determined this defense is. Great play by the linebacker to come up with the ball after the fumble. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead, and on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. On the ground and he won't get back to the line. I thought they might have been able to exploit the over pursuit of the defense. But not on that play. That brings up second and 13. It's second and 13. Ball on their own 38. The Mustangs had one of their key players go down earlier, but it looks like he might be able to get back in the lineup. Fires quickly and he's got his man. Brought down at the 49. tailback and they make the stop at about the 41. It's first and ten. Ball on the 41. Tackled after decent pickup. it to the 21. From the 21 yard line. First down. He has some room. Tackle around the 11-yard uh, line. The halfback option gets them 10 yards down the field. The offense calls a timeout, and they've got two remaining. <laughs> Up the middle for a nice game. This is the kind of steady, strong drive that coaches love to see. Right now, they're firing on all cylinders. And this play is number eight on the drive. Good outside run there. Call it a game of six yards. That brings up second and goal. From the one yard line. Second down. And it pays off. Touchdown.
tacks on the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. Right, as good as this defense has looked, I'm not necessarily surprised by this shutout. I mean, you and I were there on Wednesday watching this team practice, and when this first-team defense goes against their own first-team offense in a practice, sometimes it's actually better than the game itself. So they prepared themselves very well to have this kind of game. Fires to his tight end, nothing to it. That pass didn't look exactly right when it left his hand. Sometimes you don't get a great grip on the ball, and it comes out a little wobbly. It's second and ten. Ball on their own 30. He's going to try and scramble, and he's going to be sacked. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. So that sack leaves them a little ways to go here. It's third down and 13. this cornerback. The defense here comes up with a huge interception. They've already got the lead, and it looked like this offense was trying to get back in the game, but that was a big turnover. From the 40-yard line, first down. Throws it away. He sails it long. And he holds in the deep pass. Excellent play here by the quarterback, making the proper reads and finding his playmaker for the score. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A quick two-play, 40-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. They line up to kick this one away. And he just got stood up right there. An interception cut this offense last drive short, so I think they're going to be looking for a little more success right here. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. And that'll do it for the first half. Still plenty of football to be played. 24, nothing. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. This is Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. The first half was a complete mismatch. We did not expect a margin like this. 
now the question becomes, not only are you down on the scoreboard, David, but you're down mentally. What kind of toll does a beating like this team took in the first half have on your psyche? Well, when you come into a game and, and you're favored or it's supposed to be a really close contest and then all of a sudden you start getting kicked around, I think the first thing is, do I belong? <laughs> Am I really as good as I thought I was? And they got a second half to come out and prove it. But right now, They've had no answers whatsoever. Everything has gone the other way. Everything's gone poorly. Everything's gone bad. So if they're going to turn this around, they better start believing that they belong and come out in the second half and start making some plays. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. It's going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call. All right, Reese, David, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. He's out to the 30. Well, his defense played so well in the first half. I was very impressed. I know that. I couldn't be more impressed with how they carried it over to the third quarter. Well, the most impressive thing is the way they have been able to maintain that into this second half. They played lights out in the first half. But they just seem to be getting better as this game goes on. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Zips it to the back. He's pushed out of bounds. The 33-yard line. That's some pretty timid play calling right there. Let's see if they decide to open it up a bit more. From their own 33-yard line, it's second down. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. First down. Catches it, and that's all. Good work here by the defense to keep him from making something more out of that play. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Caught with room to work. Steps out of bounds at the 49-yard line. They pick up two on the pass play. Well, it's a good job here to just secure the football, but he just doesn't have enough speed to turn that into something big. And a quick throw. And he's taken down at the 42-yard line. Gain of nine on the play. That makes it first and ten. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 42. Now he's scrambling. They'll make the sack. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. And that's what happened there. At the 43 yard line. Gain of three on the play. That makes it third down. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 32. He faked out everybody in the stadium. When you can sell the run that well, you're going to have the upper hand on the defense. This is the ninth play of this drive. This offense just has so many weapons to defend. They've got some genuine playmakers. And they're looking to get two points here. And they won't get the two. Quick strike to the receiver. A nine-play, 71-yard drive. But the failed two-point conversion keeps it a six-point score. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of center. The score now, 
24-6. He's tackled at the 46. Now they practiced all week this week, and they told us yesterday, Brad, that they felt pretty good about what they put in, the plan that they had. And I think now that you see them playing today, it's no wonder they felt so good. The offense is coming out on the field, and they haven't had any problem finding the end zone lately. It's second and five here. Ball on the 49-yard line. And he throws it away. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. He's a big target that the quarterback can rely on. That's a smart play looking to him to get the first. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. He's at the 30. The 10. And down he goes at about the three-yard line. come out in a goal line set. They go to the back and he's hit immediately in the backfield. Loss of one there for the halfback. That brings him second and goal. Second down, goal to go. Ball on the four yard line. He's tackled around the three-yard line. That's a gain of one on the play. That makes it third and goal. This defense not wanting to give an inch here. And it pays off. Touchdown. the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. The quarterback is on his way back onto the field, and he led a great drive last time out. Going long. And that's his receiver who's wide open. Tackle made at the 10. What a great play. This is the timing that we talked about in the pregame that they must have in order to be successful with their passing game. That time, the quarterback threw it to a spot, and his receiver was there to make a nice grab. Now it's first and ten with a defense trying to regroup after giving up the big pass. He's taken down at the 13-yard line. another carry and he makes it out to about the 11-yard line from the 11-yard line third down it's not 
knocked away, incomplete. Well defended that time. You're right. Great job here by the defender playing the ball, keeping his balance and getting in the way of that pass. It's up, and it's through the uprights. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He'll return it from the three. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. I'm sure this defense came out in the third quarter expecting to get some stops. They haven't been able to do that at all here in the third quarter. No, they've got to think outside of the box at this point. They just can't slow these guys down. And I think this is where you always want to be willing to take chances, especially late in the game. Maybe you send a couple more blitzes, take a little chance, live on the edge a little bit, and hopefully it pays off for you. He's tackled around the 24-yard line. Loss of three on the road. That brings up second and 13. Second down, 13 yards to go. Ball on their own 24. Scrambling around. He's to the 40. Across midfield. Brought down around the 34-yard line. We head to the fourth. 31, 9. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. He makes his way to about the 22. You talk about a dual threat guy, this guy can hurt you in the air or on the ground. From the 22 yard line, it's first down. He makes it out to maybe the 20 yard line. Gaining two yards. That makes it second and eight. to the nine. play 72 yard drive and that's good for a touchdown and brad right now the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches opening up some big running room. so the score now 38 9 and it looks like they're ready for the kickoff taken from the three yard line they'll bring him down at the 20. and it'll be interesting to see how much fight this team has left in them this has been a brutal game Around the 30-yard line. That's a game of 10 on the play. That'll make it second. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. And he's got the junior. They'll bring him down at the 38. That's a game of 8 on the play. First down. He's going to lose big 
yardage. He's tackled immediately after the catch. Loss of five there. That's just a sound play by the defense. They dropped him well short of the line of scrimmage. It's second down, 15 to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. Kill, kill, kill! Throws complete, he's got space to work. complete he's got room to work and he's taken down at the 45 yard line call it again first down from the 45 yard line first down Green pass. He's got his hat back. They'll drop him for a loss. They get a one-yard loss on that one. Really? They just had nowhere to go after the catch. two-yard line that makes it third and, and so it's another third down upcoming here Go four. makes the first down catch and he's tackled around the 28-yard line number 30 makes the second at the 28-yard line that makes it first and 10. It's the ninth play of the drive. A little over a minute in the game. And he's going to be sacked. I mean, as an offensive lineman, this is the worst thing that you want to see. Your quarterback not only getting sacked, but getting hit like that. Those linemen better pick that quarterback up and start doing a better job of taking care of him. So the sack makes this a second and long. Catch and he's got room here. The Mustangs will use their first time out of the half. This is the 11th play of this drive. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. Well, the stop made there late in the fourth quarter, but this game's been over almost since the beginning. And I think it's time for everybody to head to the locker room. It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. Well, that one should do it. A fourth down stop here late in the fourth quarter, and that should be the nail in the coffin in this game. I think they had to go for it given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. Well, late in the fourth quarter, this game has been over for a long time, and now we just want to get out of here like these two teams do. Oklahoma! Brought down in the open field. their own 38 yard line first down and this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock the offense lining up in a victory formation and he takes a knee
Today we saw a game that wasn't even close. 38-9. So that wraps things up for us, 3A Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.